What's up everyone, EnadZT here, and I got a gameplay for you of me on Domination on Underground. I don't really like Underground as a map, but this is a 93 and 6 gameplay with specialists, so it's 93 kills on my own. Oh, actually, there is a Moab involved. It should have been, actually, there's only one Moab, but this is this should seriously have been like a triple Moab. Like, I, I pretty much get like a triple Moab. It's, I get a lot, I get two other good kill streaks on here, but I die like... Only a few off, actually. I'm not exactly sure of the uh, the actual number of uh, how many I was off by, but there were pretty good kill streaks and everything. And I probably, if I didn't choke, I probably would have gotten a triple Moab. But it's only a single Moab, so it's a double fail. Anyways, um, the class setup I'm using is the I, I don't do this enough. I don't say the class setup enough. Uh, the class I'm using is the PP90 with silencer and rapid fire. My perks are extreme conditioning. It's yeah, it's extreme conditioning, um, hardline, and steady aim. Uh, the reason I'm using hardline and steady aim is because, uh, okay, y you can't like mix up your perks that often. I see a lot of people using like quick draw and steady aim, and that 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 makes no sense to me. I just want to talk about this for a quick second. If you're gonna use quick draw, quick draw is a perk that allows you to aim down your sight faster. So what's the point of having a perk that helps you hip fire better? It it doesn't come. It's not a good combination in my eyes. So if you're using a class that has quick draw and steady aim. Uh, you should probably change that, in my opinion. It's not something that you should really do. I mean, it's just, it's such a weird, it's, it's just a weird concept to me. Why would you have a perk that allows you to do one thing, and then the another perk that does the complete opposite? So, in my opinion, you should not use Quick Draw and Steady Aim together. Like, you should not use, well, you could use Hardline and Stalker, I think. Uh, hardline, if, if you just, like, aim down the side a lot, I think Hardline and Stalker could be uh, a viable option. But, uh, in my opinion, you should definitely not use Quick Draw and Steady Aim together. Anyways, about the gameplay. Oh, actually, more about the series. This is my uh, the new series I'm going to be starting. It's going to be Road to 100 Kills. I'm not going to be posting like all the gameplays I get in like one session, just trying to get 100 kills. Yeah, uh, that'd be really boring. There's a washing machine. <laughs> that'd be really boring, and uh, I I don't think people would enjoy that. So I'm only going to be uh, posting like games that are close to 100 kills. So it's just going to be normal gameplays. It's just going to be have like a name, so I can figure out how many tries it takes for me to get actually close to 100 kills. Um, but so I already have a couple games stocked up like 85 and 3 and st stuff like that so hopefully you guys will enjoy this game oh, this game this gameplay dead man's hand okay another tangent let's go <laughs> I'm pretty sure blast shield deflects dead man's hand now or it counters dead man's hand because there's another point in this game where I, I shoot the same kid and from like point blank and he does not kill me with dead man's hand because I have blast shield on so if you guys agree with me, or if you guys have any sort of like idea if, if if this is true or not, please tell me because I want to use if it deflects or whatever counters Dead Man's hand, I'm gonna be starting. I'm gonna start using it. So uh, definitely, if you guys have any like experiences with uh, having Dead Man's hand not work on you, it definitely tell me because I, I really want to know. But anyways, what I want to talk about in this gameplay, without any more tangents, hopefully, <laughs> is going to be uh, uh, what was it? shoutouts. I almost forgot the topic. I'm going to be talking about shoutouts and um, what I think of them, and obviously my approval of them. Here's here's the other dead man's hand. Yeah, I, I, again, I I die, I don't die, so I don't really know what that's about. But anyways, uh, what I want to talk about is shoutouts. Obviously, like I just said, it's I, I do agree with shoutouts. Obviously, if it wasn't for Pone shouting me out uh, twice, actually, I wouldn't have this many subscribers. Pretty much all of his subscribers, or all of my subscribers, are from him. I don't know of many others. I mean. Uh, I know Mark and Jay shouted me out too. I didn't even ask for that one either. That was really cool. That that one made me really happy just because like, I literally I di I didn't even talk to him and he just gave me a shout out for no reason. So that that was a pretty cool thing for him to do. I really respect him for that. I actually respect him in general, but still, you guys know what I mean. Anyways, uh, obviously I do believe in shout outs and I do believe I do believe it's actually I do believe I do believe I um it is pretty sad that nowadays in um, the community the only way to really get big is off shout outs or you can go around spamming comments. I mean, how many people do you guys know of that have that have like s more subscribe? I don't know. Let's, let's just use me as a base. How many people do you know that have more subscribers than me and have never gotten a shout out from like recently, like whatsoever? I don't even know if that made sense. How many guys? How many people like have more subscribers than me and have never gotten a shout out? I mean, if they do, that's really impressive. Um, but two people that do come to mind. Actually, I should say that for later when it actually makes sense. Um, I will give shout outs to people in general. Uh, it's only if I believe that they deserve it. And that doesn't mean, oh, I got a, a 50, 51 and 1 gameplay. It's like, no, I, 
that's not something that deserves a shout out. Just because you have one good gameplay, it's like, yay, that's cool and everything. That's totally fine with me. But that's not something I want to like uh, tell people to go subscribe for you for. And it's like, I, I don't understand why people think you should get a shout out for that. I've never thought that, even before I got my shout out. Like, it seems like the, the only reason I would give a shout out is if you're doing something original or if you're doing something new that no one else can do or has done. And uh, two people that do come to mind are uh, Nonstop7 and Jay Nasty. Uh, both of these two people are um, they're complete monsters at this game. I think both of them have put up over 10 100 plus gameplays already. So that's kind of that's kind of freaking ridiculous. I don't know about you guys how many gameplays you guys have that are over 100 uh, kills, but both of these guys not combined like individually they have like 10 plus gameplays. And then there's one other person. Uh, well, first of all, those two people have um, I think they have like 5,000 7,000 subscribers somewhere around there. I don't. I'm not really sure. I haven't looked at their channel recently. Uh, but two people. Uh, that one other person that does come to mind when I think of like people who deserve a shout out. He he uses a dazzle. I have no clue what his name is or anything. This guy was. This is stupid. <laughs> I don't know why I died there. Anyways, uh, there's one guy. I think he has like a dazzle something. He has a really bad quality. Like I don't know what he uses. But he puts up like a hundred plus gameplays like no other, and he only has like he only has like 300 subscribers, and I have no clue like. I have to go. F I have him literally after this commentary. I'm gonna go search for him again, and all three of these people are going to be in the description. You guys can go check them out. Uh, they're all monsters and everything, and it's 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 something really cool that like people are able to do this kind of stuff. And I, I really don't know how how they manage to do all these like gameplays and everything. It's ridiculous. I remember I watched like Jay Nasty's gameplay where it was like he he gets like a ridiculously fast Moab. Even though if he's using uh, FMG nines, he gets like a ridiculously fast Moab on Fallen. And uh, I just thought, like, I was just looking at him, like, this guy is amazing at this game. I don't know why he doesn't have more subscribers. And especially why he doesn't have more subscribers than me. I mean, it's like, I, I don't see why people, I still, I know I'm very pessimistic, but I still don't realize, like, why people subscribe to me. I don't, I don't understand. And please don't tell me, oh, it's because I like your commentaries. I, I, there's plenty of other places to tell me that when I actually talk about it, but still. Uh, I, I just don't get it. So, I, honestly, I'm probably not going to give that many shoutouts in general. I'm definitely not going to be doing that many dual commentaries just because I don't like dual commentaries. Um, the one with Pwn, I was so awkward in it, I didn't know what to talk about and everything. It was it was really sad. And it, <laughs> that whole one, like, boyfriend joke was... I, I laughed about that so hard. I didn't know what to say, though. I was like, oh, what? Huh? And it, was, <laughs> it was just so funny how awkward it was. I didn't know what to do. But I, I'm pretty sure I'm not going to be doing that many dual commentaries. I might do a few with like people I actually know. That's one thing. Well, I don't want to do a dual commentary with someone I have no clue who they are or anything. It just seems like so... I, I don't know why I would. This is a really good streak I'm going on. I, I think it's like this point where I was like, dude, I'm totally tearing into these kids. Like, not going to lie. <laughs> yeah, I sound really weird when I talk apparently. Dude, dude, like totally dude. Anyways. I wanted to go back to the, um, what I said before about how the only way to get popular is to get shoutouts or to spam comments now, it seems like. There's a lot of people I've seen recently who are saying like, oh, go here for uh, edits and this and blah, 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 and like stupid things. It's like, if this is the point where this quote-unquote community is going, it's, it's not somewhere you want to be, obviously. It's such a stupid thing about how... That, that's literally the only way to get popular, and it's really sad because I know these people like they they want to get big and everything, but if they've you literally have to resort to the lowest of lows to actually like it seems it seems like the lowest of lows. It this the, the community is going more downhill than this gameplay right here. It's like I get <laughs> stealth bomber, then I get like instant killed in like two seconds. I think like three EMPs go off like <laughs> a few seconds too. Um, this community is um. This community is uh, tail ending right now, or whatever the word I want to use is. It's it's really going downhill from here. It's really sad and everything. I I really don't like it, but it, it's such a sad thing for me to see because I've I've been here since the beginning. It feels like uh, I've been here before Xcal did commentaries. I before Hutch was donated a PBR, and it it's I've been here for a pretty long time. I know there's people who've been here longer. But I, I'm going to do an uh, actual video on this uh, sometime in the future because I jump on bandwagons because, uh, you know, Zerka did uh, a video about it, Dysfunction did a video about it. And uh, I don't know, I, I don't like how this community is going and it's, it feels like it's really sad that we have to start resorting to really low life, well, not low life, but like really stupid tactics just to get popular now. I, I don't, as much as I do believe in t uh, shout outs and everything, it's not, it's not something that I really condone and everything. I, 
it's something that's it, it shouldn't be that way that this is the only way that someone can get popular is off someone bigger than them getting shout outs or box for box or paying for views and stuff it's it's kind of ridiculous to me and I, I feel like I think the spamming for comments too is like really pathetic I mean the, I'm pretty sure they leave a comment on their main account yeah voice crack on their main account and then they uh, go log in on like 15 other accounts and start thumbing up the comment and that's just that's so stupid to me I don't get why kids put that much why, why would you do that it's so it, it's it's baffling to me it, it really is I don't understand why people really want to resort to that and if that's really how they want to get big they're they're never gonna be someone who's like huge in the community obviously I do hope that I'm going to have a voice in this community and everything but I don't know if I would actually resort to you know doing tactics like spamming comments and everything I, I would never do that I would I, I honestly hope that none of you guys do that either. I don't know if you guys noticed, but I actually do. Um, if anyone does advertise their channel on my um, uh, on my bleh, on my comments, then I actually do block. I don't block them, but I remove their comments. And if I do recognize their name as someone who repeatedly offends, uh, you know, spamming comments and everything, I have to burp. <laughs> if I do recognize them as someone who repeatedly spams comments, I'm actually going to start blocking them. And I, I don't want that any of that on my channel. I, w I want to be a paradise. I want to be some. I want to be like an escape. That's where I want to be. <laughs> it sounded really weird, but it was kind of meant to be. Anyways, hope you guys enjoyed this gameplay. I didn't because it should have been a. Ro uh, it could have been a lot better. I should have gotten a double Moab, almost even a triple Moab. But anyways, thank you guys for watching. This is a 93 and six gameplay. Go check out those beasts in the description and see ya.